So then, we've not really done that much filming since we've been here. I'll be honest with you, because, once again, I cannot be bothered. I'm too busy enjoying it. I'll give you, give you a quick look round. This is the Great Northern Bushcraft Conference, September 2015. And as you can see, there's quite a few of us. <laughs> yeah, we've got got all the usual suspects, Stokey Joe and Dog Soldier and uh, who else? We've got Frog Moon, Wild Camps over there, we've got Prep Nomad over there. We've got the one and only Northeast Bushcrafter, can you believe, over there. Um We've got lads uh, over there doing a bit of metal detecting. Uh, everybody's happy, as always. Um, and we've got a little special event going on today uh, to celebrate the birthdays of some of the people that are here. So we shall bring you back later on and show you how awesome that said event is. Bye bye. Alright, <laughs> YouTube. Right then, we've got everybody back at camp now, everybody's chilling, doing their own thing. We're just about to go into the barn and get our evening's entertainment on the go, at which point I will bring you back, because you definitely want to see that. Uh, striking hand, just returned, I don't know where the bloody hell he's been. But good timing, because we are very shortly going to be going into the barn and getting on with tonight. Really pleased with the turnout, um, another good turnout, another good event, everybody's happy, everybody's doing their own thing. Uh, we did a 10 mile trek yesterday. Uh, and then I rather cleverly decided to go to the pub afterwards and chase up the 10 mile track with uh, a few too many pints, to say the least. Um, but you live and you learn, what can I say? So this morning did not feel too good. So I managed to miss the walk that Barky and Andy and Dave went on um, up Mantor, which is up there. Give you a bit of a zoom in, because there is actually about 20 paragliders up there. I don't know if you're going to be getting them, guys. But they're absolutely everywhere. You probably won't pick them up on this, to be fair. They're too far away. But there you go. So, yeah. Cracking set up. Everybody's happy. Jobs are good. Uh, time to go into the barn soon, so we will bring you back very shortly, oh, guys. Read YouTube. Right then. So at the minute, the campsite is like a ghost town. Everybody is gone. Nobody is here. And that's because they're all in here, in the barn. Because me and Lenny being superstars that we are, decided to put on a little, a little party. So I'll give you a quick look in, so you can see how much fun we're having. <laughs> ah, the fog bucket. Everybody's loving it, mate. <laughs> We've got his bucket now for his tab. Yeah. Because, uh, he says pizza dude, but I was just calling a few of Pizza dude! <laughs> uh, no, no. Oh. No, we, we're going to get food on and then sit and chill. Sit and chill, you alright, Mike? <laughs> 
What do you reckon? It's all right in here, isn't it? <laughs> Just can't wait to get this scrammed army now. <laughs> How's it going? Good. So all our fucking hard work paid off. Me with my hangover today. We're in here. Sorting this fucking place out, sweeping the floor, getting everything tidy, shifting all the stuff out, getting that fridge in, putting that table up. You know what I mean? Get, and then obviously Richard, because he's a lad, he got us all the bales out. And we were like, they'll do for tables, get them in. Job done. I quite like it. Cozy. You know what I mean? Hello. Everybody's having fun. Are you alright? <laughs> what do you reckon to our little uh, little gathering? When you said I've got a little surprise, I've just went, you know what it is? It's going to be what you said last time. This is if it takes off next time. Uh, What's in it then, pig? Uh, What's in it, pig? Nah, we're doing pizzas, pizzas, pizzas. We weren't going to go with hog rolls simply because we thought, as appealing as it sounds, 75% of people probably won't eat it. Plus, one of them, really, you need 200 people to eat the frigging pig. It is as well. Well, obviously it can be done, but when, it, when, he, when, he, when we were asking about it, he kind of said, no, if you're getting a pig, you, you're looking at having fucking 200 people, because if you're not getting 200 people, it's not worth you doing it. And I was like, right, well, that's that out the window. And then obviously we heard about the pizza guy and he's not long set up and he's from Edale. And obviously we got on to him and we thought, well that's it, who's not going to want pizza? Guess who? Huh? Guess who? You. <laughs> You're joking. <laughs> I cannot believe that must. <laughs> Is it what is it just is it below your standards? Because I know you do like your cooking, don't you? Yeah. Yeah, I know. Yeah, I've not, I've noticed that. There's not much of anything. It's just meat. It's just meat, eh? Well. <laughs> it's going to get messy in here tonight, I think. You alright, Bob? Bob the camp dog, look. He alright, Bobby? Good boy. You having fun? That little tail wagging. Hey. You're a good lad, aren't you? Are you alright, boys? <laughs> Some, some ales in there if you want one of them. <laughs> Any 
any smokers as well? There's a, there's a bin at the door for your fag butts. Camping, so I, I got her a cake with like birds and rabbits and squirrels on. <laughs> <laughs> and then we've got we've got a Batman cake. We've got a Batman cake for Andy. Go on, Andy. Go on, Andy. <laughs> it's dim today because Drew dropped it. <laughs> He's oh, already done. Uh, <laughs> that's a great one. We've got, it's not a cake, it's a curve. What was on there? Now, I looked for ages to buy him a cake. And the only thing I could come up which was funny was. One tiger, it's one tiger. Yeah, one tiger. <laughs> SpongeBob SquarePants. <laughs> Because he's got, because he's got square, square pants. pants. <laughs> 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 yeah, drink that for you, guys. Happy <laughs> day. <laughs> You're welcome. <laughs> Every time we ever meet, guys, if you can let us know, if we're organising it and we're coming up here, if you've got a birthday to celebrate or all that, let us know and we will plan some of Thanks it's a lot. Here, it's yeah, but next year what we'll do is we'll move it down yeah, a week. <laughs> so, I just want to say thanks a lot for coming up. I hope you've enjoyed today. I hope you enjoyed the weekend. Get them videos out and all those people that sat and watching it will go, that's where I'm going. And they'll come up to Edel for the Great Northern Bushcraft Conference. Is there anything to say, mate? Thanks a lot, guys. with me lemonade all right no honestly to, just a big thank you to everyone for coming down i hope you've all enjoyed it uh, it's been a pleasure to meet you all it's been a pleasure to uh, enjoy your company for the weekend a big thanks to obviously richard for all his hard work on our behalf and obviously the farmer and obviously the great work of the uh, the pizza dude big round of applause for the pizza dude I forgot about Richard the farmer because he's, he's been weak, and he's been weak. He's been weak. He's all right. It's cracking bloke. Him and his family can't do enough for us, guys. Hope you enjoy it. Get stuck in, eh? Yeah. Enjoy.